Well, joining me now is Councillor Keith Gregory, who you just saw in that report from Kieran Jenkins, and Bill Britton, a former Deputy Police Commissioner here in North Wales. Well, Keith Gregory, do you have any confidence now that you'll be listened to and believed in these latest inquiries? I, I'm quite hopeful. I'm quite confident, to be honest, now that um, uh, the, the Prime Minister and the Home Secretary and the Welsh Assembly have promised not to leave no stones unturned, and, and that I'm quite hopeful. Bill Britton, we've had dozens of police investigations, more than a dozen council inquiries, the, Water, the Waterhouse report, all of these inquiries, and yet so few convictions. Why do you think that is? I think there's lots of reasons. I mean, for me, the way forward is, is quite properly to have an outside force investigation, and that's been called for, as I understand it. I think it's very important that right up front, everyone is, is required to declare whether they have been or currently are a, a mason. Because the Masons were and maybe still are very powerful here. I mean, do you do you think there were people being protected by pillars of the establishment? No, there's an investigation to be done, and, and clearly that's not me because I'm retired. But the, uh, the the fact that the questions there needs solving, it needs clearing once and for all, and the the suggestion that there could be undue in, influences has to be has to be dealt with. I I, I was never a Mason, ne never have been, ne never will be. Um, and I was always very clear on that, and therefore it never touched on me. But I think if, you know, it's that concern that if you don't know, you just don't know what's going on in the background. Keith Gregory, are the, the Masons uh, uh, an avenue that needs to be investigated? Masons definitely need to be investigated, especially here in, in North Wales. Um, I think nearly everyone, especially on the list that I have, are all members of some sort of uh, Masonic lodge.